Poppy's nighttime nature sparkle. Once upon a time, in a far-off land, there was a playful fairy named Poppy. Poppy was no ordinary fairy, she had a unique gift. She could light up a garden with the glow of starlight. One evening, as the sun dipped below the horizon, Poppy fluttered her wings and flew into the heart of her favorite garden. This was no ordinary garden. It was a starlit garden, filled with the most beautiful flowers and plants, all shimmering in the soft starlight. With a twirl of her wand, Poppy sprinkled starlight all around. The garden came to life, each leaf and petal sparkling with a soft, magical glow. The garden was a symphony of light, a spectacle of nature's beauty under the stars. As Poppy danced around, she noticed tiny eyes watching her from the shadows. She was not alone. The nocturnal insects had come out to play. There was the gentle moth, with wings as delicate as lace, the busy beetle scuttling along the dew-kissed leaves, and the curious cricket, singing his song to the rhythm of the night. Poppy greeted each one with a warm smile, lighting up their paths with her starlight. The insects, in return, showed Poppy their nightly routines, teaching her about their unique roles in the garden. The moth pollinated the flowers, the beetle cleaned up the garden, and the cricket serenaded the night with his song. Poppy learned that each creature, no matter how small, had an important role to play in the grand scheme of nature. It was a magical night, filled with new friends and discoveries. The starlit garden was a place of peace, harmony, and shared joy. As the night grew deeper, Poppy sat down on a leaf, looking up at the twinkling stars. She felt a sense of contentment. The garden was not just a place of beauty, it was a place of life, a place of learning. Poppy realized that the magic of the night was not just in the starlight, but in the life it illuminated. The garden, under the stars, was a place of wonder, a place where every creature had a purpose and every moment was a lesson. As Poppy closed her eyes, she knew she would continue to light up the garden with starlight, not just for its beauty, but for the life it nurtured. The starlit garden was Poppy's home, a place of magic, a place of love, and a place of learning. And with that thought, Poppy fell into a peaceful sleep, under the stars, in the heart of her beloved garden. And so, every night, Poppy's starlit garden comes alive with the magic of starlight, the beauty of nature, and the harmony of life. It's a reminder to us all that even in the darkness, there is beauty, there is purpose, and there is magic. The End I hope you've enjoyed the story. I definitely enjoyed sharing it with you. Now let's close our eyes and calm our minds and drift off to dreamland. Sweet dreams and good night.